Hey everyone, it's your boy Roz live. So, Sony just released a new messaging app. It's um, it's a whole new dedicated mobile app for PlayStation messages now. So, if you have the PlayStation app currently, which I have, I have the PlayStation app. Um, you can no longer use the message feature on that app now. You have to download a separate app in order to use the messaging features, like send messages and whatnot to um, PlayStation users. Now, I, I got mixed feelings for this, man, honestly. That's why I wanted to make this video. For one, the messaging app, it, it's it's cool, for one. I'm just gonna say, like, you know, it's cool being able to, you know, to send messages through your phone. You don't have to worry about going out and buying those little keyboards that hooked into the, um, your controller or whatever, you know, because those, those things, can, they can cost a lot of money. I know for, like, a PlayStation 3, they, they ran for, like, 50 bucks in order to do that. And it does help out a lot, because, you know, you could just send a quick message without having to hit pause on the, um, in mid game and then send the message real quickly you know typing it real fast or whatever so you get to do it on your cell phone which coming you know really handy however i really don't like the idea of having you know a separate app now but the separate app does come with some bonus features as far as like now you can send you can have like favorites so you can send group messages you get to group all your friends in different little you know categories or whatever so you can send messages to certain people or send messages to everybody so it makes things a little more easier it's, it's pretty cool that's, that's really dope i like that feature to it however like i said like i really don't like the fact that you have to download a separate app now now this kind of reminds me of like the facebook you know because when you have facebook now you can do all your facebook you know features on one app but then you have to have a separate app in order to send messages and you know personal messages towards people and it just got me thinking it's just like wondering like if it, are all the apps gonna do this now is every app now if you wanna you know play the main features within the app now in order to you know to get the full capabilities of the app you have to download a separate application in order to have the full experience of the app you know what I'm saying like it's just it's just it's just a mess man I'm not I'm not feeling I'm not, I don't like having two apps it's just more apps it's just cluttered with apps you know i'm the type of guy i like to have just a certain amount of apps on my phone i don't like having a bunch of apps just an app for every single thing that i do use and then i said i don't go around downloading just anything on my phone i don't like that you know and i just prefer just to have you know just a couple of apps running everything or just one app that does everything like will be great but now you know that's what's happening so you know facebook's doing it playstation is doing it wouldn't be surprised if Twitter start doing it, Instagram start doing it, you know, or even start, you know, start games start doing it now. Now, if you want to play, you know, games, you play games one way. And if you want to send messages on the game, you know, you got to download a separate app with the game. And it's just it just kills me. And I, I kind of know why they're doing it. You know, it's about more money. That's what it all comes down to. You know, when you can download a separate app, you can run ads on that app as well as the other app. So it's just it just creates more you know more hits more revenue and, and that's that's all it comes down to you know now people will say oh it's more convenient it's not really there's nothing more convenient than having one app that does anything it's not convenient to download another app in order to do one feature when you had an app that can do both of the features you know what i'm saying so that whole idea of oh my god it's just more convenient now no it's not more convenient you know i don't even have the facebook messenger app now now what i do but I, I sign in into like the um, Safari on my um, iPhone, and sign in that way, and then send messages that way because I just don't want to have an extra app. Like I don't want a messaging app. Like it's just dumb, you know. But yeah, that's how I feel about the whole thing. Um, you guys, let me know how you feel about it. You think it's cool? You're gonna download it? You know, some of you guys probably don't even care. You probably like I'll just stick to the normal way of doing it through the PlayStation. You know, the actual PlayStation Four. But with me, you know, I kind of like the um, iPhone support. I don't even know if people even use it, but I know I use it. So um. You guys let me know in the comment section, do you like it or not? It's your boy Roz Live. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm out. Peace.